This is Tanara Kuranov, your friendly neighborhood gamer mouse, and, well, more rock climbing. Apparently we're in grade 512C, 48% done, so that's good, considering, oh, we've done like 16 parts of this already. Jesus, this is a long game. Long, 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 long game. What's a V4X? Emmanuel not included. What wall are we on? I don't know what wall we're on, so let's just go to you. Well. Uh, this says V4X. The wall just says V4. I guess I'm a little confused on that. Climb the technical right, Arete. Traverse behind the flake, then up to left, Arete, to the top out. Looks like there's an accent symbol there. It's supposed to be Arete. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce it. Like, well, I know. I'm just reading the guidebook out. I don't know how to pronounce these fancy foreign words. <laughs> a fall from the upper section would likely be fatal. I wonder if that's what the X means. If that means that it's a higher than usual round. Let's see what... I assume here we we're talking about going under the flake and over here. Oh boy. Roy. Yeah, he's still talking about clues, so... Nothing new. Uh, we just got X grip, so our shoes are in perfect condition. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. Ugh, that was a long technical. Holy crap. Oh boy. Oh boy. Ugh. Okay. And we are now in the unsafe zone. Ah, fuck. No, I missed it. Twice. Go on. Fuck. That's a great way to start off part of your Let's Play light, right? Yeah. By dying. Fuck. I guess this is a dangerous bouldering route because the top of it isn't exactly, well, frickin' bouldering. It does not fit the definition. What, there's another one? Jeez. Okay. Well, we did it that time. No on-site, but... Meh. Whatever, I guess. So that's... That done. Emmanuel not included. I wonder if Doctrine of Faith would be too hard. That would be forcing pretty hard already, so... Establish on the big sloper, dino to the good in-cut hold, and move through the powerful finish. And of course, dying means we reset our experience points, so yay. Break. Okay, so I guess we... Damn it. What the fuck? I'm supposed to dino from here? Oh, okay. So, oh, whew. we made it. On site. So we were supposed to dino from the very bottom of the cliff. Interesting. I was wondering why we couldn't do anything, but apparently that's why, so... Sweet. Boom, Doctrine of Faith, on site, solo. Okay. I don't think there's anything else we're going to be doing on ists and isms right now. I can't remember the V uh, conversion to the normal grade conversion, but the V, uh, the V grades will kind of start pretty high on the normal scale as it is. Like, I think it starts at 5.8, or something like that for V1 and keeps going up, so... Yeah, these things are graded pretty high. Um... 
I don't think there's any more V4s, but probably not, no. Um, tut tut on Poo Corner, let's take a look at that. Where is that? I don't care if there's new updates to install Windows Update, leave me alone. So, tut tut. Yeah, it's better than my Spin Doctor Let's Play where the Avast or whatever it was literally popped in right into the game window. Like, damn you Avast! And I think it made me die too. Cause I couldn't see what the frick I was doing. Climb up some... Climb up, do some techie moves and traverse right where the footholds disappear. If you can manage to stay on the rock, down climb around the left facing corner to the crux RDT. Best these sloping holds and top out. Oh, fun. It's a little zigzaggy, but, uh. Uh, mm, thanks for. Thanks, little crux segment, for sending me into the freaking no man's land, or no holds land, I guess. Damn it! Fuck, no on site for me. Ugh. What the? No. Frick. Frick! Oh my god. Oh, what? What the frick? Okay. How do I get past this part without losing my grip then? What the fuck? The fuck? What the fucking shit balls? God damn it. I'm just gonna fall off the cliff right now, so what the fuck? Ah. Okay. How do I do that properly? I'm not even sure. I have to stay where my hands are low to the... I guess so. I guess that's how we do it. Our hands have to try and stay on the holds. Okay. We got it. We got it. Uh, okay, took us a moment, but we got it eventually. So that's tut tut v five and uh, bloody Sunday, bloody hell. <laughs> uh, hope it's not like super offensive to British viewers or something like that. Assuming I have any British viewers, I don't. I don't know. I don't even know my own demographics. I just play things and record them. <laughs> Marketing expert I ain't. Move up to a horizontal feature, then dino to a good hold. Traverse high to the top out. Galatia Bloody Sunday. Right. Uh, it's the very first route, so... Move over to the left. Bloody Sunday. So I guess we dino over there and... uh yeah, okay. Hey -ya! Ugh, there we go. Well, that was just one dino. That was That was a pretty simple on site solo. Cool. Ding 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 ding. Alright, so that's ten minutes in and we've already got a few good routes under our belt. And Almost have experience for another attribute point. Sweet. I'm guessing there's no more V5s to do here, though, so... Nope. Definitely not. Um, let's take a look around here. HQ Mountain Pass. The guy wants help with tank or something, but... Yeah, I don't know if I'm equipped for that, that's for sure. 
Let's see the hole, see if there's anything. Uh, a couple of 511 C's, which should be within our league, right? Mystery machine on inter inner sanctum. Nine bolts make this climb a safe challenge. This route is fraught with technical. Oh, jeez. <sighs> Shit. Technical challenges. I don't like. Yeah, fraught with technical challenges is not a phrase I like to hear. Uh, move up to a long roof, traverse right, then up to a good rest. Move through the wide chimney, then out left to a powerful sequence on the face. <sighs> oh boy. Oh boy. Wait. Oh, I'm on Inner Sanctum. Oh, Mystery Machine's right over here. Okay, first of all, um, clip in because apparently I'm not, because bouldering. Nine bolt. Now let's look at this route. Seems at least like it has plenty of uh, holds. Comes up to here, comes to a good rest. Another decent rest up there, it looks like. I don't know what the purpose of that is. Probably just to throw you off, so don't go off to the left after that rest hole. And then we come up here and finally make it all the way up here. Did it say anything about dinos? I'm not sure. Yeah, just a powerful sequence. Okay, so finally be off the uh, bouldering routes and use our golden rope again. Um. Hmm. First, let's talk to Bob, see if he has anything to say. Nope, nothing new. Okay. Um, let's do it then. Okay. Damn it. <laughs> okay. At least the dead point crux doesn't fail you if you miss, but then you only have so many chances to get it right. Ah, geez. I think those bats knock you off the cliff, I'm not sure, but not taking my chances. No, definitely not. Ew. <laughs> Got a hair in my mouth. Gross. Blech. Oof. Ah, geez. Okay. Damn it. Ugh, there we go. Rest, which isn't seem to do much. Let's move on. Damn it, what the hell? This thing was kinda these things are becoming kinda off kilter again for whatever reason. Ah, uh, now that's a good rest hold. That was a good rest hold. Yes. Said something about a powerful sequence, so power crux. To the shots. I think we did that on site, didn't we? Sweet. Sweet cookies. Sweet biscuits and gravy. Sweet, I really don't know what the heck I'm talking about, but whatever. Sweet attribute point. Most importantly. I notice when you go to this menu, if you move, if you hit left and right, like when Uncle Bob's following you here, you pull up the menu, you hit the direction you're going, and Uncle Bob moves ever so slightly. Weird. So that's a slight little glitch I guess I found just now, but, uh, yeah. Okay, let's look at the guidebook again. Mystery Machine. 
on site. Awesome. Um, there's ribs and bones in the Great Within, 511C. You have to jam in a couple of small stoppers to protect the first series of challenges, so this is our good old traditional climbing route. Then move to the rest. Traverse left off the jug and jam a big cam behind the flake, which is your last good piece. So, let's take a look at that. Ribs and bones, it's right here. How convenient. So yeah, small little stoppers. Go up, rest hold, up. What the heck? There's a beaner up there, I guess. Way up there. Um, and over there is the actual... I'm not going to go off route for the beaner just yet. That's off to the left. But it said I could get a protection behind the flake, which I assume is there, that flake. Um, so i got to bring big cams of some kind. This route doesn't seem like it has a lot of protection, though. So I almost wonder about just trying to on-site solo this thing. Because, uh, I don't know. I may just try that, because it doesn't seem like there's a whole lot of protection to begin with. So you know what, let's just do that. It seems like it's almost not worth it. Okay, man. Took a lot of energy out of me, but rest, hold. Yeah. And then we'll move over here. Boom. Okay. Boom. Oh, power. Come on, get to the shots, get to the shots, top out, top out, top out. Top the freak out, son of a dick. Well, shit. I think if I'd done protection, I probably could have on-sighted that. <sighs> Damn. I thought the benefits of being lighter would outweigh the protection. Sadly, it does not appear that that was the case, so... I guess we're going to bring protection this time. Big cams, a couple of them. I don't know what exactly I can shove behind there, but, uh... <sighs> Damn. That's another death, and we lost what experience we did have. <sighs> yeah, let's go, I guess. Damn. I was so close. I'm so close to soloing it. Damn it. Mm. Okay. I'm so close. <sighs> Sucks. Wait. This isn't the flake, is it? I guess it is. Okay, so I guess that's my last good piece of protection, huh? Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm guessing that helps me. Yeah, that helped me enough to reach the shuts, so... Yep, did it now. Hmm. I thought I was gonna on-site solo a friggin' 511C, but I guess not. So, ribs and bones. Red point. Definitely red. There was some blood involved in getting that route done. God bless you. Tyler clone number 42. You died for a good cause. <laughs> I 
zero defect. If you are climbing 12s, this route may be a manageable on-site. It protects with mostly small gear, though you'll need to place a bigger cam behind the lower flake to keep yourself from decking. There is no trickery, just powerful climbing into dino. Okay, let's go take a look at that then. Zero defect, grade 512A. So it seems to go up here, and then up along here. We dino, which looks a little tricky. There's some bigger cams involved in there, and yeah. Okay, let's take a look at what protection we need. Small stopper, teeny nut, another teeny nut, another teeny nut, and dino. There's some bigger cams involved there. So, it looks to be like, take five of those and then, uh, I don't know if I'll need those, but I'll take a couple anyway. Same with that, same with that, same with that. I don't think we need a purple cam, big huge cam, I don't think we need that, but, uh, yeah. Okay, and I am tied in, because I think I want to be tied in for this one, so, um, yeah, let's do this thing. Clip into there. And I think, unless I'm missing something, I basically have, a. Uh, I can place trad gear basically anywhere because I've learned everything I need to know from trad chica, I think, so. Yeah. Oh. That, that looked like it touched me, but it didn't seem to do anything, so. Yeah! Got it. Fuck. Get me off this thing. I'm, like, stuck. What the hell? What the fuck? What the fuck? No, this is bullshit. Get me off this thing. Son of a bitch. No! What the... What the fuck sauce? No. Bullshit, I'm stuck. What the fuck? God damn it. What the fuck was that shit? I got stuck trying to place freaking protection there. What the dick? Seriously, what the hell? That was bullshit. <sighs> okay. So apparently the bats don't hurt you at all. Which is a good thing. <sighs> now fuck that crack. I am going to place protection over here. Maybe. Maybe not. Fuck you, crack. But this one, no, apparently. What the hell? Son of a bitch! Damn. What the fuck? Hell, what do I do? You know what? I'm going to bring a big huge cam and see. Cause I don't know. What the hell? I don't know what's going on there. This I can seem to climb with. No problem whatsoever, and just slap that in there, and... Yeah. Damn it. Yeah. And then we just kinda... Go along that way. Do a nice... Ah, fuck. 
I was gonna say a nice dino over, but I screwed that up, so... Fuck. Okay. Let's try that again. Damn it. This is giving me a lot more trouble than I thought it would. Manageable on site, my dick. <sighs> Ugh, got it. Okay, so apparently I am friends with the bats. Or something. <laughs> okay. Okay, what the hell? <laughs> okay, apparently it protects the big stopper instead. And apparently that's not letting me... Damn it. And I'm gonna fall because... Hey, what the hell? I didn't even run out of energy yet. What? Okay, so now I know what to protect it with, so I can leave, uh, this frickin' stuff behind, apparently. Maybe that'll help, I don't know. Jeez. Is there a rest I'm missing? Do I need more of a stat of some kind? I, I don't even know. Yeah. Yeah! Ugh, got it. Okay. Okay, we got it. Dang. Uh, well, we got it eventually. Right, right. Okay, and... Man, we still don't have another experience point. Jeez, those take a while. Okay. Well, we did, uh... Zero defect, eventually, which was a 512A. A bonus round is a 512 B. Oh. I don't think we're ready for that yet, though. So let's go to the coast of Ashball. I don't want to try soloing that last route with the seagull yet. Um, I think that was on Celebration Rocks. Duckies, yeah, I don't want to do that yet. I want to have, like, just a few more mental points. Actually, I saw some attribute points on the hole in the grate within. The indicator says attribute points. I wonder where those are and if they're on any sort of manageable route I could try and obtain them on. I'm curious. Because if I could get some free attribute points, that'd be freaking sweet. What's the point of this up here? Absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. Um, I assume it's because some of the routes are higher than others, but yeah. Um, I want to know where they are, so. Uh, Boxen. Grade 5 9. That was where the gold carabiner used to be, I think. Yeah, it used to be right up there. Now there's. Nothing, nothing but a memory, not even an old Paton to remind us of our victory. Which is kind of sad. I kind of wish the old Paton was there and I could say, Yeah, you know that spot? There used to be a gold carabiner there. Yeah. The gold carabiners are definitely worth it for the rope, because you'll eventually be swimming in cash anyways, so... Yeah. And the gold carabiners aren't worth the $750 you get from selling them. They're just 
$750 is kind of meh compared to, you know, sweet prototype rope that makes you even lighter when you're climbing. Um, I think that was out. Where are those attribute points? What the heck? They must be around here somewhere. What the hell? It says they're here somewhere. Um, what the heck? Must be around here. I know they must be because it says they're on the wall somewhere, so. What the hey? Ah. That's one problem with this. It's really hard to tell where the pickups are. So you just gotta, like, manually scan the walls until you happen to find it. And then figure out how to get to it, I guess. Where is it? Come on. Where is the bloody thing? Ugh, oh, good lord. It almost looked like it was supposed to be something over there, but it doesn't seem to be. So... Balls, where is it? Seriously, where are the attribute points? I, I don't even know. The hell? Like, nowhere to be fucking found. The hell? Fuck it. Hoping to get some free attribute points, but never mind that shit. If I can't even see the damn things. Dogs of Akumal, I don't know about that. Um, this seems to be the lowest grade thing we haven't done yet on here. Um, what about 62 River Valley? We have Monkey Screw and we have 70 Technical now and a bit more Mental. I suppose we could try that again. See what we need for that. Um, yeah. Mostly smaller stuff, but... Uh, Not sure quite what else I need, so... Okay, let's take a look at this. Okay. Oh my lord! How much does it expect us to... Is there some other path I can take on this route that doesn't have all of those technical cruxes or something? I mean, jeez. They're not technical cruxes, balance cruxes. Frick, I should know the difference. I hate technical cruxes. Can I go off this way? Apparently not so much. Did I get myself stuck again? Jeez. Heck. Uh, apparently you're supposed to... Damn. 
Apparently it's supposed to take that route. Holy crap. Maybe if I were lighter. Hey, what the... Bullshit? I just fell. Just randomly. What the hell? Okay, you know what? We're just gonna take most of the stuff off. And we're going to do it that way and see if it helps. Maybe it will. Shit. What the shit? How come that balance crux seemed to go a lot quicker this time? What the hell? That was fucking weird. Okay. What the shit? God damn it. I'm not gonna have enough energy and I fucking know it. Damn it. Okay, I... See, so it's 511B. I think I'd be able to do this shit. Damn! Holy frick! I'm still not ready for- well, we have more mental. Uh... I guess we're gonna have to lose one of those stoppers. What the hell? So hard for the greater route it is, it seems. Fuck. Yeah, I don't- I don't even know. The only way down is up 510D on the fungal wall. I bet we could do that. Oh wait, since we have six tries on it already, what the heck? Um... Well then... Two, three, four, dino... Five... Six... Seven, eight, jeez. I saw one on the holds already, though, so... Wait a minute. Go back. Hold on a mo. Oh, I thought the grade on here said 511D on the route name. I guess not. Frick. Okay. Oy. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Perfect little dino. Yeah. Okay. Seem to remember we go this way. And we do. We got another little anchor. And there's a beaner right up here, so yoink. Might as well nab that. Because why the hell not? Oh jeez. Okay. Okay. Uh, not the best rest hold in the world, but uh... Oh, what the hell? Get to that. Oh, what? That's not a rest hold? God damn it. What the shit? Fuck. You gotta be kidding me. Ugh. What the hell? Okay. Um, what the hell am I supposed to do then? I guess since we've already grabbed the carabiner, we won't end up wasting energy doing doing that, so... Still, what the hell? This route seems unnecessarily difficult. 
for its grade. I mean, I know the routes are supposed to be difficult, but it's just seems impossible unless I have better stats or some such nonsense, so... Okay. And that's as much energy as I seem to be able to get out of this, so... Oh, it is a rest hold. I just and it wasn't grabbed onto it properly, apparently. Okay, we'll do that. Go back to the rest hold, because we're at green now. See if we can't get a little more energy that way, and... Oh. Just a symbol up to the... Okay. Whew! Now we finally did that route. Finally... Yeah. Finally did. The only way down is up. Seriously, I don't know how... I still don't know how your son got on top of this route. Your son is clearly insane. <laughs> and I guess I'm supposed to free solo it to help them out, but... <sighs> a 510B. And I seem to remember this having some really preposterous technical cruxes. In fact, let me climb that again and see, because yeah, I seem to remember there being some insane crap on this route. I, ima I imagine for this it's a uh, mostly little stuff and maybe a couple smaller cams and besides I guess we if nothing else if I deem that this is pretty much impossible for me at this point I'll have some experience points so I seem to remember all the technicals right about through here though ah, I was trying to chalk up what the hell Thanks, game. Okay. Then again, I don't know if I really needed chalked up yet, but, uh, you know, whatever. Z, Z. Fuck, I thought that was a Z again. Damn it. Yeah, I seem to remember why I hated this route now. Fuck. For the batshit insane technicals, yes. Z, Z, X, Z, right. Front, left, X down, fuck! X down, X! Damn it. We may try and free solo this if I can get the technicals down right. That's really the only problem I have here. So, yeah, let's see. Z, Z, X, Z, right. Right, left. Fuck! I hit... Damn it! I always get my X's and my Z's mixed up. It's like, what the fuck? God damn it! I, I swear, it's like I have vi it's like I have dyslexia for the letters X and Z in this game. Why does it have to be X and Z? I wish they could be something that are a little different, but Z Z X Z right. Apparently, I have that one down. Right, left, X down X. Right, left, X down X. Okay. Maybe I can do this. I'll put a point in the mental. See if I can't pre-solo this. 
May as well try. Could probably do it. If I get the technicals down right anyway. Z, Z, X, Z, right. That one is pretty easy. Right, left, X, down, X, yes! Free soloed! Hello, child. What, did I just collect him like an item? <laughs> For that matter, if I'm free soloing, how the hell do I help him get down from there? Wouldn't it make more sense if I climbed up there, roped in, and lower him down? Or do I... How did... How does that work? I want to know how that works. Thanks for helping me. Thanks for helping my brother. Take this clue. It may be helpful. You can have my sunglasses if you give me that pretty feather. Will you trade? Well, sweet. We got a clue out of it, and we figured out where to go next for our, uh... For our... Trading chain quest here, so yes! Yes, I will. Sweet. You're not cool enough to need sunglasses. Thanks, Uncle Bob! You know what, I'm just gonna assume what he means is that I'm so cool, I don't need sunglasses to be cool. You should give them to someone more inspiring. Uncle Bob! Or spend more time sunbathing on the beach. Man, Uncle Bob, you're really hurting my self-esteem here. Ow! Ow! Frickin' Uncle Bob. You cut me right to the heart there. I'm not inspiring? Man! I need a drink. A drink of water's a start, but I think I need something a little stronger after that from Uncle Bob. Damn, Uncle Bob, I never knew you could be so cutting. I'm not inspiring? Man. We've already done in a hand basket, right? So I'm just gonna grab that cash real quick. hee -yah! That didn't count. What? hee -yah! The hell? Oh... Okay, then. Does it only count if I'm on a rope and grab it while I'm out of control? <laughs> the hell? What the fuck? Okay. We'll figure that out later then. Right now I was thinking, uh... Gotta be somebody on the beach who wants this stuff, right? If you give me your sunglasses, I will give you my ham sandwich. Okay, uh... Da! I, I always make trade for sandwich. Yes. Very good. I have sandwich. What? what? Uncle Bob, I will give you my granola for your ham sandwich. Who knew Uncle Bob would be involved in the trading chain? Do you want to trade? Uh, sure. You need guidance. You should go to the bolt ladder wall. It may be wise to visit the guru. He did say he was hungry. So, to the bolt ladder wall we go. He said he was hungry. Uncle Bob tried to make his granola. You were just keeping granola and... Hey, what? And if the guru is hungry, why would he not just want a ham sandwich rather than granola? I am so confused. Maybe granola's healthy and the guru, being the transcendent climbing expert, only wants healthy things. I think a ham sandwich would be decently healthy. Maybe it's on white bread and he doesn't like that. I don't know. I'll teach you a useful technique if you give me your granola. Man, the guru seems to teach you really useful things for really mundane items, doesn't he? Yes. You now know the secret of Zen. Use this wisely. Oh, frickin' hell yeah! We've got Zen now. That should really be helpful if we end up in a pinch. That's... Oh, that's totally awesome. Oh, ah. 
You know what I'm going to do with that? I'm going to go to Coast of Ashball, Celebration Rocks. I'm going to climb Duckies solo, and if I get in a pinch, I will use Zen, which you use with X and Z. Just like with Chalk Lock, it's X and C. It's X and Z, and I think it does the same thing for your energy, so... Well, Alright. We have Zen, which, uh, by the sound of... <sighs> Jesus. By the sound of it, it's like... Basically, one of the most useful techniques in this game, because... Yeah, think about it, it restores your health and keeps it up, so... And even if it just restored your energy all the way, it'd still be an incredibly helpful technique. Chuck. Ugh. Now I'm waiting for somebody to do some tool-assisted speed run of this or some nonsense. Like, you see the technical cruxes, and the technical cruxes pop up for, like, one frame before they disappear, and you don't even see what was on them. <laughs> As somebody just speed runs this with a tool-assisted run. <laughs> uh, I'm surprised somebody hasn't tried something like that. Oh boy. Okay, I'm using the Zen. Apparently it just restores a bit of your energy, but you know what? That's still incredibly useful. Yeah, soloed and get off the cliff, stupid eagle. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sweet. Clear all the seagulls off the cliffs. Yeah. So, Radman, what do you think of that? Thanks for scaring the seagulls off the tops of these rad cliffs. Here, take this clue I found. Well, these people are holding these clues hostages on me. That's just mean. These people. So, we've got another clue. Cool. Awesome. I have almost 20,000 freaking cash, and... Yeah. How many do we have? We have four more we have to find. So, yeah. We're down to four more clues to find Solo Joe. Yeah. Okay. So... Our guidebook here, what can we do? Bang, bang, bang is a 513D, which we're definitely not doing yet. Uh, almost everything else we've soloed. Maybe we can solo Jim Rat Spray Lord. Let's, uh, take a look at that at D. Walton Bosch. Take a look at, uh, where is Jim Rat Spray Lord? I think it's, yeah, right over here. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, five, five bolter, sport climbing. Uh, so it's time for this Jim Mouse to try and solo this. I am friends with some rats, but, uh,. I am a mouse, and besides, I don't think any of the rats I know are gym rats anyway. Pretty sure. Down, down, right, left. Okay, I can do that. C, X, down, Z. Okay. Nothing too treacherous. I think I can solo that. So yeah, let's uh 
take the harness off and let's solo. Still awesome, we got Zen. We got Zen and that'll be so useful. Freaking awesome. Yeah. We got super awesome technique. We only have one more thing to unlock, I think, now, and I'm not quite sure how we do it. Z, X, down, Z. Okay. And soloed! Sweet. It says something about attribute points and gear on the wall. Eh, while we're here, we might as well look for those. Let's take a look. Where those may be. I don't think they're here, though. They must be off on the wall somewhere else. Well, Thorson's route? There's gear over there, apparently. Those attribute points up there. Right. I seem to remember that being insane. We'll take a look at that, actually. Yeah, I remember it was on Dude, and we... Climb over, and there was this... Insane crap over here, or something. That we do. What the heck. Try it, I guess. I seem to remember doing it before, though, and it didn't seem to turn out so well, so I don't even know. Yeah. Eh, hard to tell, hard to tell. Oh, whoa, we did it, we did it, we did it. Sweet. Sweet. Let's climb up here. And... Top it out, and sweet attribute points. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, look at that in mental now. It's still saying something about attribute points on the wall, though. So either there's more of them, or it's just not registered that we've collected them yet. I'm not entirely certain which one. There's more gear over there, so there's a couple of gear pickups on this wall. And... There's attribute points up there. Which apparently requires soloing and getting to over there somehow. How, I haven't the foggiest, but... I could always experiment with that, um, with some roped-in climbing and... First, I want to figure out how to get some, uh, gear. Where was that? Not there. Um, I think it was near Hal Dorson's route. Two, three, four, five... Okay. Okay. Oh, pff. no, I don't want to do that. Alright, let's get some pickups. I don't know if they count towards 100% completion or not, but uh, the pickups do give you something useful, especially the freaking attribute point ones. Why did I hit X? Screw you, game. Fuck your face. Uh, yeah. Z up. X down up. Jeez. Oh, Why? Just one of those tricky pots. Oh, fuck. Mm. Damn. 
That was dangerously close to the ground, too. Ugh. Oh, I didn't even restore all my grip yet. <laughs> okay, I want to go out there a bit and, like, dino or whatever, but apparently not out as far as I went. Ah, jeez. Yahoo! Damn it. Uh. Mm, damn it. Probably wearing out our shoe rubber a bit, but it's X grip. I'm sure I can handle it, right? Okay. Yo hoo! Yeah, grabbed it. Oh, Jesus. We live! We live! You got gear uh, of some kind. I'm not, I'm not exactly sure what, but... Might have been one of these green ones. I seem to remember us having six before, but I don't remember, so... Uh, I might be wrong, I don't know. Got some gear, though. Now let's climb this route proper and get my quick draw back. Or did I just get a quick draw? I might have just gotten a quick draw off of that gear, because I had one up here. I don't know. Whatever, I nabbed it. Frick. Okay. Let's try that again. Okay, then. Don't know if that was really necessary, but, uh, whatever. Wait, what am I doing? Supposed to go over here, I think, yeah? Do we? Okay. Well, now that we're done being derps. Uh, okay. Alright. And some more gear. Another gear pickup. Uh, thank you for helping me complete my gear collection. <laughs> Indeed. I almost wonder if up there where the gear is is at bouldering height. I seriously doubt it, but uh never know, I guess. Still never figured out how to get over there though. I forgot how many beaners were on this, but whatever. Can't be more than nine. So experimenting with a couple of things. First of all, getting that gear pickup. Second of all, uh, I don't know how to get up there. Okay. Oh, Jace. Decided to just go off to the right this time. Thanks. Didn't need any advance warning of that or anything, no. Okay. There's another clip in, gosh darn it. Okay, now I have to wonder about the gear. Ha! 
No rest hold, sweet. Okay, and I have to wonder how far it is I can fall. Because I know when I clip in, I end up right near... Or I literally pass right over the gear, but... Uh, yeah. I don't know if that means I should fall from there or not. Oh, but I have no choice now. Yeah, I got it. Yes, I live! Yes! Well, I got all the gear on this wall. Awesome. Now I just have to puzzle out how to get those attribute points up there. Alright. Apparently it's not by going up there, so... Not just straight up there, I gotta figure out some way to transfer over to that other part. Unless I have to smear up along the left side. I never know what this game... I never know what it's gonna do. And my game stuttered there for a second for some reason. Don't know why. Okay. Right. Okay. I wonder if I'm supposed to dino to that. And, ah, what the fuck. That's it. Problem with trying to experiment with this is I have to climb all the way the frick up there when I want to experiment again. And, uh, yeah, it's always fun. Climbing back up all that way, just have one more shot at trying to trial and error that. It seems like I messed up the dino on that even, so... Yeah. Shit. Damn it. It really doesn't seem like I can go up there that way, so... I should probably give up on that. And find some other way. Okay. I want to know how to get him, though. I'm sure I could. This route wasn't too bad to solo, so I'm sure I could get over there. Soloed, if I could figure out how to get over there. In the first place. Ugh. And look at how much power that restores with each tap now. Yeah. Okay, um... Jeez. Really... Don't know where exactly I'm going, but, uh... Can I... Climb down this way and do it? Uh... Okay, apparently, yeah. Yeah, I can. Okay, so I don't even have to dino or anything, I just gotta smear my way up the wall here, and, uh, yeah. Unfortunately, I can't top out because I'm not soloed, so we shall rectify that situation by soloing. And then maybe climb the route once more to just get our gear back. Ooh. We're 512D now. Sweet. And mental stats up to 68. Cool beans. To quote the Jumanji animated series. <laughs> if anybody remembers that. Cool beans! 
The Jumanji animated series was weird, but, uh... I don't know, it actually didn't seem very bad to me. Like, uh... It was weird, yeah, but, uh... You know what? I don't know, it's been a while since I watched it, so I could be just remembering things wrong, but it seemed like it had some imagination to it, at least. I don't know. I don't remember if I watched that on Netflix, or if it was YouTube, or what, I don't remember. But yeah. Seems like I should just be able to grab that while I'm soloing, but, uh... Okay, then we just... I really should probably regain some energy on that rest hold first. Yeah, just a bit. Okay. Now let's go down here. Okay, now we make our way up this, chalk up, smear our way up, <sighs> yeah, okay, boom, attribute points, sweetness. Oh, what the heck, we'll increase the mental stat to 80 first, I guess. Maybe? I don't know. I guess. Uh, cool though, we got some nice attribute points. Uh, let's clip in and get our uh, quick draw back, and then we'll explore off somewhere else, I suppose. Our Zen doesn't seem to be really recharging down there at all, though. I don't know what you have to do to get that to recharge, but, uh... Yeah, whatever it is, it's not doing it. Ow. But really, how do you do it? I don't know. I see, like, the sliver of it down there. Or maybe it's just really slow to recharge. Because... <clears throat> Because it is Zen, I mean... It, it is Zen, so uh, maybe they want it to recharge slowly so you don't over-abuse it, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know exactly how the special ability recharges work, so I'm afraid I'm not a whole lot of help in that subject. And we go up. And we should be able to just clip in the shots, and there's our quick drawback. Oh, elbow pop. Okay. <sighs> well, I think we got... Make sure to talk with other climbers. They may be able to help you. Levi Betamax is projecting routes at HQ Mountain Pass and needs help sussing out the moves on Tank. Yeah, I know that. But, uh... I don't think I'm gonna be able to do Tank, do you? I don't think so. Tank is a 513A after all. So, yeah, I don't know about that. Uh, let's take a look at Jack's rocks. See if we can't do anything. Some five eights we haven't soloed yet. That seems like that should be rectified. So you know what? Yeah, let's do that. 
Let's go to the Ninja Bunny. That is the Phantom Hand and Pucker. Let's see. One, two, Beaner we can grab. Three. That seems completely pointless over there. Just a dead end. Four, five, six, six clips, I guess? I don't know. Let's check out the route since we've done it already. Make sure there's nothing that's going to sneak up on us. Yoink. I have that beaner because I guess I might as well. I don't think there's any more use for the carabiners anymore though, but uh, could be wrong. Like I said, I don't know. But I think we have the best shoe rubber and everything, so... There's a rest hold there if I... oh. Right, down, left, down. It's like a pendulum. Consistent pattern there. Okay. Okay. Nothing too tricky. I think we can solo the Phantom Hand. All right. Okay, okay. Phantom Hand. Free solo. Mm, excuse me. And let's solo this thing. Our Zen still hasn't charged up another, even another pixel yet. Kind of weird. Okay. Alright. Doesn't seem to... Right, down, left, down. Yeah. Dun -de dun 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 That's a rest hold and it actually gives me some energy. The beat talk of the town, you need energy. There's nothing really like it. Oh, Lazy Town. Such a freaking weird show, but it had all these catchy songs and everything in it, too. Oh, look, our Zen charged a little bit more. You see that? It did. It charged a little bit more. So it is charging, but slowly, very slowly. Okay, let's go to Pucker. Our X Grip is still at 100%, it's even with all the smearing I've been doing. I'm starting to wonder if X Grip just lasts forever. I think, no, that's the Phantom Hand. We want to go over here to Pucker. One, two, three. Three. Wow. Okay. I almost wonder if I should just solo it. Yeah, what the heck. Let's just solo it. Whatever. Could be a technical crux, though. Heck if I know. Okay. Nope, just a balance. Okay. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Long balance crux for some reason, but hey. Okay. Q. 
Keep my head, keep my cool. Uncle Bob, I still don't like you for what you said to me, though. She's not cool enough for sunglasses. I should give them to someone more inspiring. Like, really? It's just... Eh. That's silly. Okay, well, we soloed that. Boom. Kicking off and soloing more routes. Kicking and soloing. Yep, yep. There's some open projects around here, but heaven knows how hard those are. And other the stuff is like many have tried, all have failed. <laughs> oh boy. Let's go to 62 River Valley and see what there is. There's still Monkey Screw, which for some reason seems to require an enormous amount of energy from me. Uh, donkey Punch, that sounds hard. Uh, Resplendence. Short balancey route. Let's go to the river wall and take a look at that. Where is it on the wall? Second to last, so it's over here. Still don't know how you get that cash. Splendence. One, two, three. Well, that's short. I almost wonder about on sighting that, like, on site solo. Hmm. Probably not. Oh, what the frick. We clipped in. Oh, jeez. Damn! Holy shit! Holy shit! That's insane! What the hell? Okay, we did it. Took two tries. Unfortunately. But we did do it. Resplendence. Awesome. I think that means we've done everything on the river wall now. Awesome. Okay. Sweet. Coast of Ashball. Let me see. Dogs of Aku Mall. I may be able to do. Grab five draws and some new rubber. I don't need new rubber. I have X grip. Ugh. This route climbs the left face in Arite. Dino from a good hold out to the lip of the jutting roof. And there you'll have to master a technical sequence to gain the right. Technical. Dogs of Akumal. One, two, three. Jump. Four. Five. And then I guess we... Over there, I don't know. And there's attribute points over there. Okay. Let's do this, see what it's like. Firstly, there's this dino, which we should be able to... Yep! There we go. We're awesome. Ah, fuck. I hit X. I'm pretty damn sure I did. Ah. How do they expect people to on-site solo this again? Yeah, damn it. I really wish there was a skill that made that move just a bit slower. 
It's really hard to time it properly sometimes. Hiya! There we go. Ugh, okay, we did it. I guess we still just, I guess we just go up this way. Awesome! Now I wonder about those attribute points. About those attribute points if I have to, like, top out and climb down to get them, or if I can get them like this and try to avoid the scorpion. Curiosity's getting the better of me, I might as well go take a look. Besides, if I can get some more attribute points, that would be sweet. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, it wasn't full. I thought those little super dino was four was to help with shit like that. Uh, I can say good luck if you're soloing this. Ugh. Jeez. Ah, fuck. I wasn't even sure if... Damn, 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 damn. I wasn't even sure if my finger's in the right position. Fuck. Okay. Let's try that again. Now we got a dino. Just right again! Okay. X, left, left, right, left. Well, that was easy. Which is good. What the fuck? Okay. I don't know, maybe you do have to top out. I don't know. I kind of just lost my grip and... It seems like your climbing path takes you directly into the onslaught of a menacing scorpion, so... Yeah. Hoop, hoop, hoop. There we go. Just wanted to get my stuff back. Mostly. Uh, yeah, I don't know how you get to that exactly, so... Screw it, I'm not going to right now. Well, my Zen's charged up a bit more. Mental up to 73. Done dogs of Akumal. And I uh, will check the other routes, but uh might call this a part for the moment. Uh, uh. Lesson number 17 we might do. Yeah, we'll try and end it with that. We'll do... Lesson number 17 on Crux of Position. See about that. Open project. Lesson number 17. Okay, a little narrow one. Mostly narrow gear. Um, God, I'm not even sure where this one goes exactly. That seems to be a different route entirely, but I don't know. Let's see, where, do, where does this one lead? It goes... Do, 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 do. Yeah, so this must lead to the shuts more on the left here, I would assume. Um, there's attribute points over there. <laughs> Got that, some stuff there. Some more stuff there, and I think we go over here and uh, up here, I guess. And then we come up to the top. So, let's see. 
There's some varying stuff of all sizes up to like mid cams. Not entirely sure, but uh, tie in obviously. Lesson number 17. Here we go. Okay, that's a green, I suppose. Fun. Oh, gosh. Ah, fuck! Ah, damn. Bullshit. Okay, wedge that in there. At least our Zen's starting to recharge. For what it's worth. Ugh. Lord. Okay. Another cam. He's not having to use a lot more cams than I expected. Okay. Ah, oh, jeez. Yeah, uh, uh, what the fuck? No! Bullshit! <sighs> fuck! Go up this way? Nope. Okay. Ugh, that is a draining crux. Luckily there's a convenient rest hold right there. Ugh. And we did it! Oh. Alright. I think that'll about do it. We've done lesson number 17, a 512A route. Four more clues. Indeed. I'm just not sure how to get to all of them yet. Um. I don't know how to get to the one on, uh, freaking Aaron Go Bra for one thing. And like how the heck do I get over here to that clue? I haven't a clue, really. And trying to do so seems to mean dying. And I don't know what it is that's locked, but. seem to have everything we would need to try and get up there, so... Oh, jeez. Hey, at least we were safe that time. Our bouldering height must have increased. Uh, I don't... Huh. I really don't know how to get to that clue, though. Ugh. Seems like we're just barely not able to jump that far. Like, not quite. <laughs> yeah, see? They're, like, so close. Now you need more physical. I mean, we have the super dino, but maybe having physical still increases the... 
throw distance. I don't know. Uh, let's look at these. Uh, I can always give a V6 a try. In fact, it may be the only V6. Tiggers and airplanes on Pooh Corner. Um, where is it? Okay, start on the short boulder, climb to a shallow pocket, and launch for a good hold on the larger boulder to the left. Don't get too caught up with this boulder hopping trickery, the top out will require your attention. So, hip, yeah, okay. Shouldn't be too excruciatingly fuck. First of all, I think I went the wrong direction. Second of all, I botched it up even if I was going in the right direction. There we go. There we are. Didn't quite on-site it, but we did do it. V6. Yep, yep. Cool. Four more clues to help us find Dad. I wonder about gathering another one of those clues. I know one of them's here, and we can't seem to get to it yet. Um, let me take a look at where the others are. I know one was on the top of a 514 route of some kind, and that was kind of like, nope. Not doing that yet. That might have been the one that was here. Yeah, let me take a look at the route that was over here. Yeah, 514B. We're not doing that yet. Thinking maybe we can get one more clue? Levi Betamax might end up giving us one too, I don't know. There's one here. So let's see what the where it is here. We'll look on the tops of all the routes, because more likely than not it'll require us to solo some route. Yeah, there's a second route here. Second route here is can we talk later? Which... Don't know about doing that solo yet, because it's a 511B. And with a dino. Man, these clues are kind of treacherous. To get two dinos. Yeah. So there seems to be one on Sin Rocks, one on HQ Mountain Pass, one on the hole, and then I think that's it as far as clues on the cliffs goes, but I'm not sure. Easiest one seems to be the one in the hole, just because that's soloing a five. No, easiest one. Well, the easiest thing to help with at the moment is probably Levi Beta Max, because that doesn't require you to solo anything. It does require you to do a pretty freaking hard route, though. Where's the one clue? My goodness. That seems to require you to solo a 514D, and I don't think we're <laughs> going to be able to do that anytime soon. <laughs> um, so... Yeah, I don't know. We may try one more poo corner. Which is... The very last route over here. Seems to be very short, but uh first a low technical face to the right. Alright, look behind the flake to the top out. 
fun. We'll do that, and then I think we'll call it a part. Yeah. Ah, damn it. I didn't hit it three... I wasn't expecting C, so I didn't have the time to hit it three times. Damn it. Fuck. Ah, uh, damn. Damn it, I hit right again. That's like the second time I've... Oh, what the fuck? It's like the second time I've done that particular mistake. What the hell? Okay, wow. Dang it, if I'd been able to... Oh, what the... Oh my heck, okay. Whew. Man. Okay. Well, we did it. Eventually. So, that's Poo Corner. And I think that marks part 17 we're on now, I believe, so... Yeah, we've done some pretty nice stuff. We're up to a grade 512D climber. We've got our stats up. we got some new routes, some new clues. Um, we learned Zen. Probably most importantly of all, we've learned Zen. And that seems to unlock almost all of the skills. So, and I don't know what the last one is, but... Hopefully we'll find out soon enough. Alright. This is Tanara Kurenov signing off, and until next time, happy climbing!